guys and welcome to another review slash unboxing of the ever after high items these items are from my latest haul this time we are going to do the raven queen destiny vanity and there are so many little neat accessories i'm excited about showing you guys and even more exciting is that i was able to find these at target on clearance for six dollars and 58 cents instead of the standard 22 23 dollars at most stores so when we flip this over, this is the back of the box. You can see all of the tidbits and things that she has. And she comes with an extra crown and cabinets for stuff, for your stuff and mine, it says. And you can find out more information, of course, at Ever After High. And of course, it tells you that the doll is sold separately. Okay, and colors and decorations may vary. Okay. On the side, you do have a few things on the side panel, and it looks like the other end of a storybook. And when you flip it all the way back around, you get the basic book. So I'm going to take a second and open this up so you guys can see it. Okay. Okay, we are back, and we have actually removed the vanity from the outer box. I would remove these from here right now, but I don't have a place to store them, so they will be stored in their box right now. So I'm going to remove Raven Queen just so you can take a look at this really beautiful chair. It has a black feather back and it goes into this beautiful purple and silver legged bottom, which is very, very beautiful. I think the Raven Queen's things are the most gorgeous stuff that you can get. Now, it gives the illusion that they have the little light bulbs on the side detail. I'm trying to see... You do have a little bit of a detailing on the back. Okay. And then you have this piece which spins and it's got a little bit of, it's like a cork board. It's got Legacy Day and little things and on the other side she has pictures. Um, the same with this one. This does spin around. And on the back side you have the other piece of cork board just like the other one. They spin around and just have little graphics and postcards and pictures and things. Then this is the um, crowns frame, which I was dying to have this just so I could like display different uh, monster high wigs on it or different things in the little shop that I have. Oh, it's just so cute. But she has her secondary crown, which is attached to it, as you can see, as well as a necklace. She also has her, I believe these are the speakers I'm trying to see here. Um, I believe these are set up to be like speakers. And this is the chandelier, which actually hangs above the vanity. Get a little better look at this. And then her brush, which also looks like a microphone. And then she has her case and perfume bottles and whatnots here. Now, what they mean by storage, while well, the Okay, that's weird. The handles are actually rubber, and I expected them to be hard plastic, but they're not. And there is storage compartment one. Okay, again, those are rubber. And then she has her drawer, which I'm trying to... Oh, it's not a drawer. It flips out, and it is actually a keyboard instead of a drawer. That's kind of cool. And again, the little details on this are... Okay, those are plastic, not rubber. And then you have the other compartment. These are a little hard to open, actually, with the rubber handles. The other compartment, which is just another set of shells with the doors. Okay. Then, of course, you have the little detail around the edges of the vanity. And around the feet, it is much like Raven Queen-esque with the little balls and the clawed feet. The chair feet are a little bit different. And that. And then you have, of course, the little lamps on the tops of these. But that is pretty much the Raven Queen vanity set, which is the Destiny vanity. If you have any more questions or want to see anything more in depth, let me know. And this is going to conclude our latest hauls reviews. And be sure to subscribe, and we will see you later. Bye, guys.